Well, a breaking news update tonight. After almost two weeks of inappropriate conduct allegations from nine women, Roy Moore's campaign is speaking out, attempting to debunk the claims of his accusers. NBC 15's Muriel Bailey has been keeping a very close eye on this case. She joins us now. Muriel, the president spoke out about this issue today. He did, Kim. President Trump slammed Moore's opponent, Doug Jones, and Moore's campaign pointed out inconsistencies and called on the media to investigate claims against Moore. President Donald Trump spoke out Tuesday on sexual misconduct allegations against Republican Senate candidate Roy Moore. He totally denies it. He says it didn't happen. And, you know, you have to listen to him also. He also slammed Moore's opponent, Doug Jones. We don't need a liberal person in there, a Democrat Jones. I've looked at his record. It's terrible in crime. It's terrible on the border. It's terrible in the military. When it comes to the allegations against Moore, Moore's campaign attempted to debunk some of his accusers' claims. One is Beverly Young Nelson. She's the one who came forward with the yearbook she says Moore signed. She says Moore touched her outside the restaurant where she worked when she was 15 years old. Former waitresses at the Old Hickory House restaurant said employees had to be 16 years of age. No 15-year-olds worked there. Nelson also claimed Moore came in almost every night and sat at the counter and flirted with her while she was a waitress. Moore's campaign says former employees say waitresses didn't have contact with the people at the counter. They also commented on Lee Korfman, the first woman to accuse Moore of sexual misconduct when she was 14. One of the linchpins of her story is that Judge Moore talked to her on, quote, her phone in her bedroom. Within days of this story coming out, her own mother told Breitbart News that there was no phone in her bedroom. Moore's campaign says the allegations are attempts to sway Alabama voters. The question is, can you be tricked? Can you be tricked? And Moore's campaign also said the operations manager who worked at the Gaston Mall for 26 years said he never heard anything about Roy Moore being banned from the mall. Kim?